The Brazilian wasp is one of the most aggressive species of social wasps. Its venom contains chemicals that can kill bacterial and cancer cells. Polybia polista is a species of eusocial wasp occurring in Brazil. The venom of a Brazilian wasp contains a special molecule called MP1. MP1 molecule kills cancer cells by creating holes in their lipid membrane. The MP1 molecule selectively kills cancer cells without harming normal cells. To explore the potential of the MP1 molecule as a cancer drug, more studies are still needed. Cancer treatments that attack the lipid composition of the cell membrane would be an entirely new class of anti-cancer drugs. This could be important in developing new combination therapies. Where many drugs are used simultaneously to treat cancer by attacking different regions of the cancer cells at the same time. As a potential cancer drug, this is not the first venom being explored. The venom of scorpions has been gaining interest as a source of new drugs. It contains a mixture of biochemicals called peptides. Some of these are known to cause cell death by forming pores in cell membranes. Cell death can be useful if we are able to target cancer cells to autokill. These venoms can have very powerful effects. One specific small peptide, known as TSAP1 extracted from the Brazilian yellow scorpion, has both anti-cancer and antimicrobial properties. Studies show that some of these substances have the capability to attach selectively to cancer cells and block their growth. Using venom to treat cancer is not as simple as injecting these proteins into a patient. A courier is needed to deliver the protein right into the cancer cells. Scientists are exploring the use of nanotechnology to guide the venom to the right target. It may also be possible to coat the nanoparticle in a biodegradable layer. This helps trap its toxicity until it reaches the target region. Once it reaches the cancer site, the layer degrades and releases the toxin.